Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So about two years ago, I posted a video that Microsoft Start had replaced Microsoft News as a new personalized news feed. Now, the reason I'm mentioning that video, which by the way, for what it's worth, I'll leave link down below and in the end screen. The reason I'm mentioning that video is because I have noticed in Edge Canary, 129 which is the latest preview version that it seems now that microsoft is thinking of going back to its roots for want of a better saying and msn microsoft network has reappeared on the new tab page with a new look and feel so in the stable version of microsoft edge we get microsoft start to the top left on the new tab page and in edge canary we get msn to the top left and if we click on that, obviously that opens up MSN online. Now, in case you're wondering what the difference between the two is, is MSN, which stands for Microsoft Network, is an online and internet service brand of Microsoft. And is a, this is according to Microsoft, by the way, and is a service platform that covers many different online features and applications. So that's what MSN is all about. And then Microsoft Start, a little definition of that according to Microsoft is it's a personalized information and news service and it's designed to provide you with customized news, information and other content to meet the interests and needs um, that you're looking for. And Microsoft Start can be accessed on the web or used as an app on mobile devices. So basically that's the difference between the two. So I thought this was interesting um, that Microsoft could be coming full circle and going back to MSN on the Edge new tab page. And at this stage, I'm only seeing this um, on one of my devices. So it could be something like Microsoft is A-B testing in early preview. Or in, in true Edge Canary fashion, it could be a bug. But um, just letting you know about it, because it's one of those little small details at the end of the day, um, what I would consider to be a small yet significant little detail that could be changing once again uh, in the browser. And if this does revert back to Microsoft Start, obviously, I'll keep you guys posted. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.